Also since noontime, after police respond to a dog fight in Warwick last night, an officer ends up shooting and killing two pit bulls that police say were attacking another man's dog last night. Eyewitness News reporter Jared Pliner is working the details now live in Warwick for us. Danielle, good afternoon. Well, police now charting a timeline from last night, and they say it appears early in this investigation that officer's actions were, quote, lawful and necessary. Two dogs work police describe as pit bulls shot dead by an officer last night at a fenced in home on the corner of Post Road and Titus Lane around 6 o'clock. No owner's home. Police say they showed up to the two dogs attacking a smaller one, a man lying on the ground. One officer pulled his taser. Police say that didn't work, and the second pit bull turned on him. He fired his pistol twice at the second. The officer then tried to help the man. Police say the remaining pit bull attacked, lunging and trying to bite. The officer attempted physical force. It failed, and he fired his pistol twice more. The small surviving dog went to a veterinarian. Its condition unknown. Its owner went to a hospital with bites. Neighbors heard the yelling and the shots. That adrenaline just probably got him out, and, and unfortunately, this, this is the result of what happened. We've never had no issues with him. I've been lived here for a little over a year and never had no issues with him. Eyewitness News spotted what appeared to be a taser gun next to one of the deceased dogs. The police officer's name has not been released. Multiple uh, witnesses interviewed, according to the statement we received, police saying they showed up to that fight happening in the roadway, and we asked, therefore, did the dogs jump that fence? Police responding, that is under investigation. Live at work, police this noontime. With the West Bay Mobile Newsroom, Jared Planner, Eyewitness News.